rather unique race in that they, it was caution free except for the stage breaks last year at the road course races they gave stage points but eliminated the stage breaks brought them back for this year but otherwise not an incident free race but a full course caution free race Not even on the burnout. Plenty of fuel, too. <laughs> it's still wide open. <laughs> yeah, that's a great shot, though, with that drone following that car, doing that burnout. Great burnout by William Byron. Good feeling, too, isn't it, Kevin? It is a great feeling. Well, a lot of the credit goes to the men standing on that wall because on that final green flag stop, they got Byron out first by a good margin. And needed it. Needed it with Bell closing in on him. blow the tires off of it. They're melted, Kevin. I just hope it doesn't catch the mud flaps on fire. Tell you, in front of us on pit road, I see a bunch of tired drivers getting out of these cars. This was a workout. Yeah, that's a that's a full day's work. And, and we see right in front of us, we see Corey the Joy laying on the ground. Sure is. Uh, on the outside of his car. And I, I can't express to everybody at home, Austin Sendrick walking around his car exhausted. Uh, these drivers have given it everything that they've got, and it's a full day's work. Jamie? Well, William Byron admiring the burnout. He literally burned them down, gets picked up by Landon Walker. Starts the year as the Daytona 500 champion. You come here today, William, get your first win at Coda. So many opportunities to make mistakes on a road course this size, yet you seem flawless. How did you pull it off in such a dominant way? Yeah, I feel like I made a lot of mistakes in the last 10 laps, just little micro errors, and Christopher was really fast there um, on the longer run. But uh, this sport is just so hard. It is so difficult to, you know, week in and week out, show up and have fast cars. And uh, we've had a little bit of a rough stretch the last few weeks, but just put a lot of prep work in this week. And um, just thankful for the team I have around me, all the people uh, back home as well. Uh, Joanne, who helps me, and uh, Ken, who is here today, uh, Max. So all these guys play an in integral role in preparing, but uh, just super thankful for uh, having this opportunity. And Raptor, Chevrolet, Valley, and Liberty University, all of our partners, Exalta, Valley, yeah, everybody, Hinder Cars. So <laughs> it's just a lot of fun to uh, to win races, and it's really difficult. Oh, and Relay, too. So, uh, But we're going to enjoy this one. All right, we talked about your boys over here. Your pit crew got it done today, three seconds faster than the one that got you back out in the lead. What is it like having a team like this that you know you can count on when you come down pit road? Yeah, I just feel like when we're when we're on, uh, we're firing on all cylinders, whether it's pit road, strategy, uh, calls on top of the pit box for changes in the car. So um, just thanks to everybody on this team. There's not enough people that get credit, but uh, this is really cool. And um, like I said, we prepared really well this week and um, it's just difficult, man. You just gotta keep keep working. All right, William Byron gets it done here in Austin. Well, Christopher Bell comes home in the runner-up position today. Christopher, you were coming at the end there. Looked like this 20 car was really fast. Did you just need another lap there? Yeah, I mean, obviously once I got to him, it was gonna be tough to pass him, uh, but just needed a couple of mistakes, man. William has been really, really good on the road courses, and he was flawless when it mattered today. Saw a conversation post-race there with, with Kyle Busch just a moment ago. Was that about the contact in turn one, and how did that go? I mean, yeah, obviously he's he's very upset, which, you know, he ended up turned around. And, you know, first off, I'm, I'm sorry to Larson in the five car. I got him earlier in the race, and uh, by no intention at all, I didn't mean to do that. But, you know, KB is so frustrated about what happened in turn one, and, you know, I, I don't know. We were They were too wide going in there. I, I haven't obviously seen a replay yet, but, uh, you know, I, I had no intentions of turning him, and, and I'm sure we'll talk it out before the next race. Thanks, Christopher. Josh? Well, another strong day for Ty Gibbs, who comes home third. What more did you need to finish two spots better today? Yeah, you know, we were just a little bit too loose um, in the right-handed corner, so uh, I just wish we were a little tighter, but we did a really good job today. My team did a great job. Um, all props to them. Uh, thank you to Monster Energy. He gets us interstate batteries. Um, it was a good day for us. Uh, good points today. We'll just keep working hard. Five straight top.